Ross County were looking to win three straight top flight games for the first ever time. Taylor Sinclair with his left foot over the free kick. It's knocked away by McLean for Gabriel Piccolo. Can turn it into the middle, it's a good ball too. McLean away, only as far as Higginbotham. Michael Fraser flying to his left-hand side to make the save. And it was a good one, because this was brilliantly struck by Higginbotham. McLean, route one towards Jordan Slew. Piccolo did well under the physical challenge of the man on loan from Blackburn Rovers. Oh, McLean takes a chance with that one. Higginbotham, and he can't get the shot away. Scott Boyd steps in to bail out his centre-back partner. Oh, McLean just looking to skim that one off the top of his head and back to the goalkeeper. Higginbotham was onto it. It's Higginbotham's corner. Up goes Taylor Sinclair. Looking for the space to send a cross in. Instead, he gives it away to Tidzer, but one back by Lawless. And now Lawless... Good ball in, and Balatoni, what a chance. Well, they don't come much easier than that for six-foot-plus centre-backs. You would expect them to score there. Economou. Forward to Jordan Sloot. That's nicely done. Michael Tidzer now. Tids are across, Britain, and tees up Philip Kiss, who finds the back of the net on his debut. Just 23 minutes in to his Ross County career, the man on loan from Cardiff City has the opening goal, and all three of the new signings involved. Gary Glenn pulls wide. Economou, and it was too far away from Carey. O'Donnell to Lawless, who took that one in his stride. Now releases Lyle Taylor. Taylor! Oh! The shot too hot to handle for Michael Fraser. And Lyle Taylor has his second goal in his last two games. And this is the difference that he brings to Partick Thistle. Well, what a start to the game. Ross County's lead lasted only five minutes. Britain. Oh, and it went all the way through. And Fox just had to palm it straight out. It could have gone to anyone in the six-yard box there. O'Donnell to Lawless. Cheaply given away, but one back by Stephen Lawless. Muirhead. Taylor Sinclair. Lyle Taylor! Partick Thistle have a new hero. Lyle Taylor, two goals in 11 minutes. And it's Alan Archibald's side that leads. Pinpoint cross from Taylor Sinclair. And a devastating header from Lyle Taylor. Way by McLean. It's with O'Donnell, though. That's nicely done. Elliott. And now Lola saw oh, it's 3 1 now. The second half is just underway, and Stephen Lawless has his fifth goal of the season. It's his third against Ross County after getting two in Dingwall. Higginbotham with a clever touch to set up Lawless. Could Partick Thistle be on for their first home win of the season? Britain. Back to Tidzer. Nicely done to Carey. Carey keeps it on the left foot. Britain! Well, somehow it stays out, but Gordon! 
turns it in. Ben Gordon makes it 3-2. Ross County very much still alive in this. It's Ben Gordon's first goal since November 2010. Richard Britton. So close to the equaliser. The Ross County captain inches away there. What a game it has been at Fur Hill, and there's still plenty of time left for more drama. Britain. Here's Philip Kiss again. He's already got one. He's now got two. An incredible debut from the Slovakian midfielder on loan from Cardiff City. Two goals in his first game for his new club. Calmly tucked away to make it 3-3. Stuart Kettlewell comes on for Gary Glenn just to sure up that midfield a little. Here's Britain. Carey now. No way past, it's Britain. Little loose with the pass and in goes Kettlewell. His first involvement in the game is for a late lunge on Ross Forbes and it's a red card. Bobby Madden sends off Stuart Kettlewell. There was a wild challenge. He's only just on the park. He has only been playing for about a minute and Stuart Kettlewell has the long walk to the changing room. Can Thistle find a winner against the 10 men? Your head. Taylor Sinclair is already provided one cross for a striker to score from. Whips another one in again. It's O'Donnell, oh, what a hit. It's just wide. Stephen O'Donnell, the right back, almost scoring spectacularly to win the game. But the full-time whistle has gone. And Partick Thistle have surrendered a two-goal lead, which denies them their first home win of the season as they continue. It's a 12-game winless run at home, their worst run for 100 years. Subscribe now for free and catch all the action on SPFL YouTube.